Hello there and welcome to another episode of Feed the Beast with me, Stocko Gloss. And Dare Tubbers. How you doing, Dare? I'm good, how about you? I'm very well. I'm eager to get today. What are we going to do? We're gonna, I think we're going to go exploring, aren't we? Yes, we need to go exploring because we need sheep again. Sheep? Love it. Okay. So uh, I, I guess we, we don't need sheep, but do we need wool? Yes. Okay. We, we, really. Eventually we'll need to corral some sheep so we have a infinite supply of wool. <laughs> um, do sheep, is it still is it still uh, seeds or wool? Uh, not wool, uh, wheat? Mm, sheep, yes, I think sheep are still wheat. Okay. Is it worth taking some wheat, do you think? Nah, you'll just end up with a herd behind you. Ah, good point. Um, so, should we go to your waypoint first? Let's go explore these waypoints out here that we ignored last time because we found a fun <laughs> to play in. Yeah, I think that's going to happen quite a lot during this series. We're going to uh, we're going to find some goodies. It's going to distract us. Ooh, there's a fire going on over here. A fire. Yeah. I can't see a fire. You can't. No. Ah, oh, that's odd because I can. I see this ground is on fire. This ground's on fire. Yeah. Oh. Um. Oh, I can see a little bit of fire up there. Yeah, I think the um. I think we had some lightning strikes. <laughs> oh, all right. Oh, cool. Good thing there were no creepers there. Oh, this is where you got the redstone from, wasn't it? Yeah. It's really interesting. I think it's going to be a really neat building material. Yeah, definitely. All right, climb, climb. Where is that thing? It's that way. So today, viewers, we're going to go see if we can find our new home or check out some places where we might be suitable. And uh, I think ultimately, should we let them decide where we settle down? It's fine with me. Yeah, okay then. So in the next few episodes, if we... Uh, if we get a few options for you guys, and then you guys can choose, and then we're settled home. Although it'll be quite difficult to record these episodes waiting for your comments. <laughs> so we'll have to do something while we're waiting for your uh, your lovely comments. Uh, oh, wow. Hey, it blew up the thing. Oh. It blew up the thing. <laughs> the oh, there's one over here. Okay. I think it's a beehive now, because it blew up in front of my face. What, the so, beehive did? Well, the creeper did. Oh, okay. Is that, is that a beehive? Is it... Yeah, I think so. It, did, did it just light up for you, then? Well, yeah. Yeah. I can't right-click on it. I got a bee. When the creeper blew up, it gave me a Meadows Princess. I don't uh. know what... The... So, viewers, if you know what a Meadow Princess is... <laughs> I can see it in your hand. <laughs> yeah. So it's just a little little bee with a crown that hovers over its head. And then this, this weird <laughs> block. And I, I actually tried to break one with a pick. And it destroyed it. Yeah, I'm afraid it would destroy it. So I don't want to keep doing that. So there we go. Wow. So they are beehives. I, I'm not sure, though, because it's not the same as the other beehives. It might be like different biomes, maybe different colors. Um Maybe. It looks sort of, on my texture pack, it looks sort of like a lizard doing a dance. That The image on it. <laughs> oh, there's no image on it. There's just there, a there hole. Is... Oh, really? Yeah, it's just two holes either side for the bees to go in and out. And it's kind of stripey, like a, what you'd expect a beehive to look, at, look like. The only difference is it's, uh, it's red. Ah, so for me, on my texture pack, it looks like a dirt block with a yellow lizard doing a dance. <laughs> Oh, that would, that would look so much cooler than what I'm seeing. It's like a Dennis and Menace jumper. <laughs> well, I, maybe that is a beehive then. Maybe. All right, and then we have this metal princess now, and I don't know what to do with that, but I'll keep it. It might bring you luck. Maybe. I I can rub it for luck or get stung, maybe. <laughs> yeah. I'll let you rub the bees. Oh, what's this? Oh, wow. I've got never seen this biome before. Yeah, this is where I got cracked sand from. Wow. Yeah, it's kind of neat. And But the water looks different, so I think there's some water over here. 
Yeah, I was afraid to get in this water at first because for me it looks green. Okay, you ready then? Go for it. Uh, oh, just feels like water. Yeah. <laughs> But because it looked green, I was afraid I was going to get poisoned. <laughs> <laughs> oh, wait, I've got no health bars left. I'm only joking. No, I do like this. This is lovely. And look at the, the waterfalls coming down. It's like blue, and then it touches this stone, and it turns, turns it to green. Yeah. It's very strange. Yeah. But there is, like, I don't want to say hundreds, but there's tens of biomes, isn't there, in this mod? There's a bunch. We have the biomes XL on, so there's all like the, this biome. I really love this biome. The there's really tall trees. Yeah, yeah. Again, we could get infinite supply of wood from just one of these. <laughs> yeah, you could. Yeah, look at look at the size of the trunks. Why? Do they yeah. go? Do they go right up to the um, top of the game? I don't know. We'd have to climb up there and find out. <laughs> I think we'll save that for another episode, guys. <laughs> we'll climb a tree, see how high it is. <laughs> and never one of us would fall off at the very... <laughs> exactly. And do you know what? Even though I'm like, I'm very uh, incompetent at this game, I still think it would be you, Dare. <laughs> More than likely. I'm willing to take the risks. That's it, that's it, yeah. I'm a bit of a chicken when it comes to things. Although I did jump into a dirty pool of water. Yeah, yeah, you can have that smelly algae thing on you now. <laughs> it's a good thing. It's a good thing you put your bed all the way down at the very bottom of the mine. That's it. Yeah, that that was my uh, that was my plan because I knew I was going to get a bit dirty and uh, I didn't want to keep you up. I talk in my sleep as well, there. So, ooh, <laughs> ooh, sheep! I found a sheep. I got a wolf. Well, that's not the same as a sheep. <laughs> <laughs> I don't know if uh, the viewers or yourself heard that, but my missus just opened the, the door in the, in my office and it creaked and it, <laughs> it sounded like a dungeon or something. You know, I have these old doors that creak. I don't know if anybody heard that. If you didn't, then that's a bit random. <laughs> I've I've lost you, Dare. Uh, sorry, I got distracted by sheep. I'm now making a bunch of naked sheep. Oh, I'm in, a I'm in a field full of cows. You're in a field full of cows. Okay, I think I know where you are. Ah, I see you. Excellent. You're actually standing right by option one. Oh, okay. I was thinking this this large field, because there's cows that you're killing. <laughs> there's pig. There's sheep over in there. And then there's this nice big biome of trees. Yeah, we're kind of on the edge of a biome here, aren't we? I think we're we're actually on the edge of three biomes. I'll hit the X pull up the map. Yeah, yeah. So we're on the edge of three biomes. We're sort of in the uh, plains biome that's stuck between that strange kind of yellow biome of some sort and then a snow biome. But we also have this really big, um, big tree biome. Yeah. I, I, can't, I can't believe how flat this is. It's like a... Yeah. It would be great for if, you know, if we decide to build a really big building or a bunch of, or like a Hagenstadt style with a bunch of <laughs> buildings all over the place. That sounds amazing. Oh, I'm loving that. Well, guys, this is uh, option one then, I think. I think Dura's cracked this one. All right, which direction do you want to go now? Um, I don't know. Let's get the map. I think I can see an edge of a biome this way. Okay. So I might go uh, explore this this way. I don't, I don't know whether should we stick together or. Um. Well, we know where home is. Ooh, hey. No, we're not going to go down there. <laughs> <laughs> you stay well, away from the ore. I'm going to go north and okay. invest this way. I'll continue going west. So we'll have to watch each other's episode then to uh, to check out the different options. Yes. Uh, oh, this is quite nice. thing is, I just think the whole game is brilliant. So I, I look at something and go, oh, wow, that's brilliant. I want to set up here. And then I just move a little bit and go, oh, brilliant. I wish I set that up there now. <laughs> I think those are... 
beehives, because there's more of them over here. All right. Have you still got the dancing li dancing lizard? Yes, they all have little dancing lizards on them. <laughs> so cool. Found a family of pigs. Well, I think we found our place to stay then. <laughs> <laughs> nope, some more sheep. This is this isn't bad either. Mm. Maybe. Ooh, what oh my god. Wow. There's some there's some oil which is shooting out of the ground like a like a volcano. And it's gotta be it's higher than all the trees. It's gotta be um uh, 30, 40 blocks in the air. Well, that could be very good. I found a swamp. You know what? I'm going to make... I'm going to say this is an option because by the swamp, we have... Well, no, we, we can build a rubber tree farm. Never mind. We need... I like yours with the, uh, the idea of the oil well because then we can get all that oil. Oh, why? Um, there's, there's, there's a lot. Uh, I mean, a lot here. That's, uh, Why don't you go uh, call that option two then over there? Okay. Well, this is option two, and it's actually, it's quite nice because there's like a there's a lot of water around us. We might be on this mini island. Let me get the map out. No, it looks. Um, I can I explain? There's like a a stream. It's very picturesque. It's like a stream going through. It's kind of like Lord of the Rings style. You know that bit where they're uh, going up the river and they see the two big statues, saying stop. You know, I, I, you probably don't know what I'm talking about, but <laughs> it's <laughs> don't worry. Not many people d do know what I'm talking about sometimes, but it's got that kind of feel to it. Apart from there's a big oil um, volcano type thing. Yeah, I've, got, I've just found an oil volcano of my own over here, but it doesn't sound nearly as nice as yours. Oh, I'm probably over talking it here. You know, yours is probably <laughs> you probably look at it and go, really, Stocko? That's it. <laughs> I don't know. Well, I'm going to call this option two anyway, guys. So um, we can have a bit of fun at this one. Let me uh, let me set a waypoint. Uh, oh, little sheep, you're stuck, aren't you? Let me get get you out of there. So option two, and put oil there, so I know which one it is. And because I let you loose, give me your wool. Thank you, sheep. <laughs> there we go. Option mm. two. Oil. Okay. Even if we go anywhere around here, to be honest, there, we can uh, take advantage of this massive oil thing. Yes. Let's see. Where is this? Hmm. This is very sheepy. Very sheepish. <laughs> <laughs> oh, you can't pull the wool over my eyes. <laughs> Uh, that was a bad joke. <laughs> bad. <laughs> okay, I'll stop. <laughs> uh. <laughs> oh, it's a entire family of several families of sheep over here. Ooh. Too bad they don't drop lamb chops; otherwise, they'd be more worthwhile. Hmm, I'm on the edge of a. I think the map just makes it look amazing as well. You know when you press X. Oh, thank you for the people that told us to press X. Really do appreciate that. I found a village. Ooh. And a giant gash in the earth that I can't get over. <laughs> <laughs> oh, boy. All right. Because that's an option as well, is taking over a... Uh, a village. A because then we have to do less work. <laughs> yeah. But we can trade with the villagers, though, can't we? Yes, we can. I'm going to find out what these guys want anyway. And maybe if they're growing potatoes, I'm going to steal some potatoes. Oh, yes, please. Hey, villager dude, what are you doing? Come here. Come back here. But they ask for something like weird stuff, like a diamond. You know, they want a diamond for like eight pieces of wool. And you're like, what? You're what? This one apparently wants an emerald for seven pieces of melon. <laughs> See what I mean? <laughs> it's so not worth it. <laughs> These guys really want emeralds. All right, this is quite pretty. This is really, this is actually a really nice little uh, village. 
All right, what are you guys growing? You growing any potatoes? Ooh, that looks like potatoes. That's... I, bet I, pot I bet I had everybody shouting at me then uh, because I, I was starting to run out of food. And I don't notice I'm running out of food until it's too late and I start dying. I found potatoes. Oh, good stuff. Villagers won't mind. No. I'll, uh, I won't kill them. How about that? There's, there's a <laughs> payment plan. Oh, you're too nice. <laughs> well, there's this really weird kind of rocky, um, oh, oh God, don't drop. Oh, ow. Um, how can I explain it? It's like a mountain, I suppose, of pure rock. And uh, it's where our river starts off. You know, I was talking about this this lush river. Oh, I can see a couple of villages as well on my uh, on my map. Are you in the middle of a like a, a ice biome? Is that where the villages are? Um, I'm right. These villagers are right on the edge of an ice biome or yeah. snow biome into a birch tree biome. Okay, I think I'm. Uh, Heading your way. You know what? I kind of like this. It's it's again on the edge of a couple biomes. There's not as much flat land, but we can always take over all these villages. Well, this seems nuts. It's like a big chasm. Oh yeah, you must have found. You must be heading my way. That giant chasm that just cuts the land open. Well, I'm at the bottom of it now, uh, sort of looking up, and it's like big mountains of um, <laughs> stone everywhere. So you know what, I think I'm going to call this option three, because I like the idea of living in a village with a bunch of villagers. It kind of makes it feel alive. Sheep. I'm going to call this option three. Let's see. Waypoints. Option three. Village. Village? Village. Yes, that's how you... <laughs> 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 Let's remove the question mark because it got blown up. <laughs> <laughs> All right, so we've got the village as option three. See, I so, I, I love this ca this chasm. I th I think we can make something really really cool here, but my only it would take a lot of work, a hell of a lot of work, which I'm not I I don't mind putting the work in, but. Wow, it just looks amazing. But um, I'm not going to call it as an option. I don't think. God, these guys really want emeralds. Oh, I'm caving again. Stop it, Stocko. Come on, we're exploring. <laughs> <laughs> oh. oh, have I turned myself around? I just walked in, I just walked into some sheared sheep, and I thought I'd just shed some sheep. I just found one villager that I would actually trade with if I had an emerald in my inventory. Well, so you got diamonds? No, one emerald for three glowstone. Ooh, yeah, that's a good shape. Hey, we need to keep that guy alive then. Yeah. <laughs> um. Oh, here's a... Oh. Well, that's interesting. You want two pieces of wheat for reddened comb. Wow. He's an he's a AP and, and a B guy. <laughs> He's a what? He's a villager we're in a bee outfit. <laughs> he's, he's in a bee outfit. He's got the guys that go out and and smoke out the bees to get the honey and stuff. I've never seen that. Oh. Uh, what's, how do I get into this place? Where's your Where is your door, people? Oh, your door is buried. I, I love how the game sometimes buries the door. Oh, I think I found... Oh, can you imagine? All right, picture this, viewers. We dig out some nice windows going all the way across there like that into a little mine base right into the cliff and then we're looking out to see every morning. I'm going to call this option four, I think. That does look quite sexy. Although I do see something else on the map. Uh, there's just loads of places that I uh, I can 
vision as living. But I'll call this anyway. I want to set a waypoint. Hmm. Anybody in here? No, just a pig. All right. Too. Let me borrow some more potatoes from these guys. And you know what? I noticed somebody in this town is trading for wheat. Ooh. It doesn't make any sense because they're growing wheat all around, but <laughs> I'm going to go borrow some wheat and trade with him. I think I know where you are, you know. I'm, I think I'm on the other side of the hills. Oh, wow. Look at this. This could be the entrance to our, our port. If we chose option four, this could be our little port where we could put our boats and a bit of a dry dock. Oh. You're really selling option four, aren't you? Uh, yeah, sorry about that. <laughs> <laughs> I fine with it. All right. How much wheat did I get? I think I need more. More wheat. Oh, snowballs. How do you people... Oh, you guys can't get out. You have to come out the other way. Okay. You've got to be careful because um, the zombies, don't they attack the... Uh... They They do attack the villagers now. Yeah. So what used to be a villager could become a zombie. <laughs> Ooh. Oh, I see a villager. Am I near you now? Uh, I don't know. Where whereabouts are you? Oh my god, he wants ten gravel and an emerald for five flint. Open. And there's some oil down here as well. If you're in the same... Uh, basically, I'm minus 1,254 plus 85. Uh, you are a good distance away from me, actually. Ah, okay. Hey guys, what's up? Who's the guy that wanted the wheat? Did you just harvest his own wheat and then you're going to give it to him for something? <laughs> <laughs> That's a bit mean, but I like it. Yeah, I didn't work to harvest it, so... Uh... <laughs> okay, yeah. I need to find a way up. I do... I do kind of want what you're, what you're selling. Let's see. Let's see. Was it this guy? Was it one of you two that was going to give me eighteen? Oh shoot! I'm short on wheat. So, any... Someone's going mad with their doors. Uh, come on, wheat! I need more wheat. Ooh, is that some? Ooh, pig dance. Got a dancing pig. Wee, dance pig dance. <laughs> as soon as you look at him and tell him the dance stops. <laughs> dancing pigs. Yeah. Hop, hop, hop. Okay, I'm at the village. What's this? Oh. <laughs> I feel so sorry for this guy. <laughs> There's a villager. <laughs> I think as I was like getting closer to this village, it spawned. But <laughs> hang on, <laughs> they built the house next to a hill, <laughs> and this villager can't get out of his door. Uh, he's got the blocks in the way, so he keeps opening and shutting the door. <laughs> I don't know why I find that so funny. I had a similar situation in my village. I rescued. <laughs> Hey, this, is a, this is a fairly big village, is there? Well, that's good. Yeah, mine's pretty decent size. Uh, um, doo -doo -doo. Come on, I need more wheat to grow. Gro Wait, do I have bones? No. I have a snowball. <laughs> oh, I missed. Alright, is that grown up yet? No. Yes? Oh, what are these things? Oh, oh an apiary? Uh, apiary? Yes. Do you know what that is? Something involving bees. Yeah. Well, you can actually click on it and it opens. It gives you like a, a GUI interface. Uh, it's got a red sign saying no queen. So I guess if you put a queen in here, it'll give you... Um, 
I guess it'll give you stuff. <laughs> I've got no idea. Viewers, we need you. Ooh, got a 21 skip. wheat for one emerald. This guy wants. Well, I need, like, what did I need now? Did I need 16 or 18? Darn it. This guy wants a princess. He wants he wants a princess? Wow. He, he does, yeah. He's shooting high. <laughs> I will, yeah. You know. The only uh, way is down. Is this fully grown? Okay. Isn't there like oh. normally a blacksmith in these villages? And they have a chest and sometimes there's a diamond in it, isn't there? Sometimes. I think. I kind of feel bad because if I leave this place, I know zombies are going to come and kill everybody. It's a nice little village, this. Ow. Hmm. Excuse me, pig. Three emerald for some shearers. No, thank you. What's this place up here? Mm, there. Okay, that's 14. Oh, wow. Uh, I'm, I'm determined to get this emerald, because if I can get this emerald, I can trade it to another guy for something else. So we have, let's see, I have... Option one and option three. You have option two and four. Yep. How many options do we want to give? Well, I don't know. Well, we could always just give the four and then uh, let the, our viewers choose. If they don't think any of the four are good enough, then uh, then we'll carry on looking. Unless you want to carry on looking, I'm I'm happy either way. Ah, uh, I I don't mind. I'm yeah. I'm just walking in circles at this point, trying to get some more wheat. <laughs> Well, we can always cut the video here and do another four on our next video. How does that sound? Sounds great now that it's raining. <laughs> <laughs> oh, I'm trying to find the blacksmith. How, do you, how does this guy get out of his house? Oh, I guess nobody lives in this house. <laughs> nope, nobody lives here. What about this house? Is Same problem. They've got some nice houses here, though, haven't they? Yeah. What have we got crop wise? We got any spuds? No. Just wheat. And that cow scared the crap out of me then. Ooh. What's this? Oh, option three has a cave attached to it. Ooh. Well, you all love caving. It's not a very big cave. It doesn't look to be. Oh no, it's bigger than I thought. Oh, what's that over there? Whoa. It's a quite... Uh, what was that? One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten villages in one house. Wow, that's 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 a comfy house. <laughs> yep. <Yeah. laughs> oh my god, get me out of here. Yeah, be careful. They might try to marry you off to their daughter. Yeah, I didn't find a blacksmith. All I found was a crafting table. Yeah, I don't think I could find the blacksmith either. And I've given up on my uh, wheat searching episode. <laughs> All right, what's in there? Nothing. Huh. Right, well, we're approaching a thirty-minute mark-ish anyway. But um, I'm I'm quite happy. What, what what do you fancy doing? Should we do another four in our next episode, or are you happy to just the four? options that we've got um you know what i 
I think I want to uh, to look at your options and see what you picked out. Okay. So I'm going to just go with four. And if if the viewers don't like any of our options, then uh, screw you. <laughs> I'm <only> joking. <laughs> then then we can uh, go searching for some more. Okay. Sounds like a plan. Jump. Oh. All right. So I am going to head sort of back towards the house. I think I'm miles away from the house, but uh, oh, I'm one thousand two hundred and thirty meters away. Yeah, I'm a, I'm about a thousand away. Wow! Look at this pretty. Oh, this is nice for Christmas, isn't it? It's snowing. <laughs> oh, look at this! What a great episode to end it on for Christmas. Oh, let me get to a Christmassy view myself. Right now, I'm just in rainy trees. <laughs> Oh, I think you'll be well gel when you see this there for a Christmas view. Oh, I can get I can get to some Christmas here too in a minute maybe. Where's my Christmas? <laughs> Someone stole my Christmas. You know that happens all the time. Someone steals my Christmas. <laughs> <laughs> I'm apparently with a bunch of sheep. Okay, why? Well, <laughs> <laughs> well, that's your Christmas then, Derek. <laughs> Thanks. Well, thank you very much, peeps, for watching. My name's Stocker Gloss. This is Feed the Beast Minecraft. Uh, my name's Stocker Gloss. Derek Tebbers. And we'll see you very, very soon. Ciao for now. Bye.